keeping with the season, I would like Legislator Kimball, Legislator Zellner to the lectern. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. And we would like to read this citation for Thanksgiving. Whereas we, the citizens of Niagara County, are grateful people, ever mindful of the many ways we have been blessed. On Thanksgiving days, we lift our hearts in gratitude for the freedoms we enjoy, the people we love, and the gifts of our prosperous land. And whereas our country was founded by men and women who realized their dependence on God and were humbled by his providence and grace. The early explorers and settlers who arrived in this land gave thanks for God's protection and for the extraordinary natural abundance they found. Since the first National Day of Thanksgiving was proclaimed by President George Washington, Americans have come together to offer thanks for our many blessings. And whereas we the citizens of Niagara County join our fellow Americans in proclaiming our thanks for those blessings and abundance and express our deep appreciation for the sacrifices of the honorable men and women in uniform who defend liberty. As they work to advance the cause of freedoms, our nation keeps these brave individuals and their families in our thoughts, and we pray for their safe return. And? Whereas, while Thanksgiving is a time to gather in a spirit of gratitude with family, friends, and neighbors, it is also an opportunity to serve others and share our blessings with those in need. By doing so, we make our county a more helpful, hopeful, and caring place. And whereas this Thanksgiving, may we reflect upon the past year with gratefulness and look toward the future with hope. Let us all give thanks for all we have been giving and ask God to continue to bless our families and our county. Now, therefore, be it resolved that the Niagara County Legislature joins the President of the United States of America in proclaiming, proclaiming Thursday, November 26th as a day of Thanksgiving. Music